The first classes of substance that we'll look at are alkanes, alkenes, and alkynes. Now these substances are very similar. They contain only carbon and hydrogen atoms. The difference comes down to the bonding. Alkanes contain a single bond between carbon atoms. The rest of the bonds are taken up by hydrogen atoms. On the other hand, alkenes contain two bonds between the carbon atoms. As before, the rest of the bonds are taken up by hydrogen atoms. You might have been able to guess that alkynes are triple bonded carbon atoms. This leaves one bond left per carbon atom for a hydrogen bond. Next we'll look at alcohols. Alcohols contain an additional functional group, which is a hydroxide group. Here again, we have several carbon atoms surrounded by hydrogen, but a single bond will be taken up by this hydroxide molecule. Next, we'll look at aldehydes and ketones. Aldehydes and ketones are a little bit more complicated. For an aldehyde, we have a central carbon atom, a double bonded oxygen atom, a hydrogen, and some functional group called R. In this case, R just means any continuing carbon chain. Ketones are pretty similar. They also have a central carbon atom and a double bonded oxygen atom. However, both sides contain this R functional group that is a continuation of the carbon chain. Next, we look at carboxylic acid, which is quite similar to the aldehydes. It has a central carbon atom, a double bonded oxygen atom, an R functional group, and an OH hydroxide functional group. The final class that we'll look at are amines and amides. Amines have a central nitrogen group bonded with a single hydrogen atom. However, there is an extra functional group R and another hydrogen atom. Amides contain a central carbon atom, a double bonded oxygen, one R functional group, and then an NH2 on the final bond. Whilst this may seem like a lot of content that you need to learn, it's all quite similar, and over time you'll be able to get a really good grasp of the reasons behind having a good understanding of these different concepts. Thank you so much for watching. We hope that this video helped and we're really excited to show you some more.